Everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Quicksell. Shop well, shop Quicksell. You got that? All right. Well, last episode we pulled off a pretty quick mission with the main lance. The secondary lance is going to get run today. Uh, let's quickly go to the mech bay really quick. I'm going to show you what I did with the Centurion before we drop into battle. So we had the rotary four, or sorry, the rotary two on there before the pirate rotary two. I thought I would change it up a little bit because I'm thinking about dropping the rotary rotaries and stuff into the uh, bigger lance when we get it running so I wanted to figure out a, a nice loadout for the Centurion sort of for the medium base lance and I think this is a nice support mech now so we've got the light AC-20 stuck in here with a recoil now this light AC-20 for some reason doesn't have any recoil I'm not sure if that was intended or not but it doesn't have any recoil so I mean it's got a jam chance yeah sure mitigated by gunnery which I tried to crank up a little bit here. I didn't really have a, a clan cockpit or whatever, which I could put in here to uh, increase the gunnery, but we do have the gunnery support A, which I dropped in. Um, we've got incendiary uh, armor piercing and a couple tons of uh, precision ammo. I also added the modular armor that we picked up uh, in one of the episodes that you didn't see into the arm location, giving it another 18 arm armor, which is great to help protect this AC. Uh, we kept the medium X pulse. The engine stayed the same. I was thinking, toying with going to a 250, but it was, wasn't really needed. It wasn't giving us any more speed anyway. And then we've got um, an SRM-10 in total here in the torso with a ton of Inferno and half a ton of regular SRM ammo. We've got a Holly and a Valiant, so this one gives us a bonus to hit, but a bonus to be shot down by AMS. This one here gives us a bonus to crit chance. Um, and... Um, Increased critical chance, but reduces the damage slightly. And then a regular SRM-2. So we got an SRM-10. We can get into play. Guardian ECM stayed on here. Recon sensors, fire control system, ballistic stayed on here. So we got a better chance to hit with the AC. So I'm really hoping this thing uh, pans out today. It does the full 100 damage for only 8 tons. So I can't say no to that. And yeah, the jam's a little bit high, but once the pilot gets to be a lot better, that's Boomer right now. I think his gunnery is like 6 or 7. Plus one, so eight. So it's only about a 7% chance to jam. So it should jam about 50% of the time, knowing me. So uh, yeah, that's um, not a bad loadout. I'm interested to see how that works today. So let's go ahead and take that three and a half mission, three and a half skull mission, the recovery. It's against the Marines. I thought about doing this one, but this one's against Tamarind Abbey and they seem to be a little bit weaker. But when it comes to Marians, they, they're more unpredictable. Uh, some of them have got really great stuff. So I'm really hoping that we can get some good stuff out of this one. So let's negotiate this guy. Going to go full salvage, of course. 419 should be pretty good. And load. And I think, what did we mark this as? Did I mark it as Lance B or B Lance? I think it was B Lance, right? Yeah. So we got the Cloud Buster. I'm going to leave the Hetzer. And I think this time we are going to bring the Yellow Jacket because I'm really interested to see if we can use this to capitalize and hopefully um, and hopefully uh, be able to get some more salvage using this thing. So uh, let's deploy and get this sucker done. More firepower, huh? Well, we're good. Interface initiated. All right, let's do this. How do they know? We just got here. Yeah. All right, they're up there. Okay. Snap. I'm good to go, Commander. We're all good to go. You're good to go, and you're good to go. They got two lances defending. Pretty much guaranteed. Um, you know what? I'm going to go, we're going to start here. We need some open space. The Avatar and the Stormcrow and our Copter, they need open area for, because they got longer range weapons, open area to be able to fire. 
And then this gives us enough cover to move the Centurion and the Stealth in. Alright, I think we're in a good spot. Orders. Let's get you up and see if we can spot anybody. Let's get into here. Roger. Alright, we got somebody over there. They got a lot of aircraft. What do they got here? The Free Yahim Yellow Jacket 58. The Scatty Quick Cell 2. Well, really, this is it? Oh, Nidhogg. Okay. Well, that. Well, there you go. That's not good. You're in a bad spot. Fingers crossed for you, buddy. Fingers crossed for you. Well, our plasma cannon is useless unless they get reinforcements. Oh, you're backing up. No, you're not. Ow. Okay. I'm catching some serious shit here, Commander. No, oh, you don't know from serious shit yet. Wait till he gets close. If he gets close. Fuck. So that happened. Over the red line. Heat damage. Doesn't look like a lot of damage though, but bad enough. Take your shots now. That's all I gotta say. Take your shots now. Yes, Commander. Okay, who do we want to target? Wow, 17, huh? Good this thing good thing this thing's designed for anti-air. Okay, let's get into here. Ten. Well, this guy's the threat. Let's take a shot at him. Confirmed. Nah, nothing. Failed to connect. It's the avatar that's got to do the work on that guy, I think. Okay, let's move into here. Really, huh? Well, this should be an interesting fight. Same on the Nidhogg, so we'll take the Nid Nidhogg shot. Nothing. Missed. You did. Ready for orders. Let's get into here. Moving to position. Much as I want to uh, target the Nidhog, we're going to get into a position where we're a little bit more protected here. And that's garbage. And that's just as garbage. So we'll go with the more shots. Well, tag hit. Orders. All right, Boomer. Um, let's give him the boom. Ten four. Thirty percent. That's actually not bad. Uh, we'll stay with. Sure, it doesn't really matter. Stay with the Inferno. Upper. Nothing got through. That's a miss. That is a miss. Yep. And then let's bring you around this way to start. Just cruise it a little bit. Cruise it a little bit. For some reason the plasma cannon won't work on these guys because it's area area of effect. Well, maybe he can be a target. Commander. All right. Well, 200 mines, huh? Did 
There's no going anywhere. So let's at least try and target this guy over the red line. Leave the large off. Fire the rest. Well, at least the tags are uh, consistent. Eighteen. They're all. It looks like a lot of them are on eighteen. I don't want to move that stealth unless I absolutely have to. I mean, it could be in a worse position. Okay, that guy's backing up. It could be in a worse position. But it's, I mean, it's kind of covered by those rocks in front of it, right? So... It's that friggin' bomber at the back that I'm worried about. This guy right here. All right. All you gotta do is land a couple shots, Senti. This guy's got chunky armor too. Chunky, chunky armor. Ow! Fuck! That was a CT hit. Reporting internal damage. Okay, that guy's gotta go. I mean, they all gotta go, but that guy's got the least amount of armor. Ah, shit, you're gonna capitalize on that last shot, aren't you? Nope. You're not. Ow. Took a hard hit there. Yeah, you lost like almost half of Taking your armor. Hits, Commander. You lost like half of your armor. Copy that. Let's see what this gets us. 27 from behind. 30. 23. I think we gotta take this shot. Looks like he's kind of blown his load here, though. the hell? Come on. Why are you being a jerk? Now you won't let me escape. Well. This guy still got a lot of weapons. Ah, uh, let's see if we can hit this guy. Here we go. So the X pulse hit. Orders. All right, we don't have. Okay, that spread the damage pretty good. Let's move over here. On the move. Didn't drop enough though. Damn. I should have reserved. God, the chances to hit. Let's see if we can get lucky against this guy. We gotta get rid of this Goss rifle. Engaging party. Alright, we hit with one. Standing by. Let's get around here. We'll do the same thing, see if we can get a side shot on him. This could be bad, man. I mean they've shot they've shot most of their big guns already, but if we can take the yellow jacket down. Oh, nice. We got one hit on it. Waiting for orders. Let's just keep up the pressure. Move over to here. Aye, aye. We got to flank both sides of them so that they're going to expose one side of the other to us. 
taking the shot. Anything. No, damn it. Confirm. Let's get up here. All right. Let's move. Yes, Commander. Look at it. Almost nothing left. I mean, we could try sprinting out of there. Two hundred and twenty one, two eighty seven, two thirty nine. I think no matter what we do, it's they're going to go after us and try and pull us down anyway. So if we turn our back as much as we can to these guys and shoot this guy. With what we got left. That chaff, man. Let's go with the. It doesn't really matter what I shoot at him. Yeah, it's brutal. It's brutal. At least their initiative is dropping. It's kind of balancing out a little bit here. Oh, okay, the yellow jack didn't didn't fire. I'm receiving you. Let's not let them flank us. We're gonna flank them. Stay on this guy. Roger. Damn it. At least we're kind of spread out now. This was an unfortunate uh, thing. And there was not a damn thing we could do about it. Like even if everybody shot at that freak before it went, it still would have got off. It's it's round. We just don't have the chance chances to hit them to take it down in time. So I mean, I'm glad the stealth pulled out in front because if that came down right where we were standing. Everybody would be in pro like mass well more problems than what we're in now. Okay, AMS is unjammed. That's fourteen. So we show oh they got someone else going on fourteen. Is it the Scatty? Yeah, okay, Scatty. Hopefully this Centurion can land a couple shots over here. Yeah, the pulse hit. I can't take much more of this. Yeah, I know, none of us can. Yep. I don't think we can use the plasma cannon on these guys, because it's AoE, right? One. Just check again. Yeah, unfortunately we can't. They know it too. Well, that really is unfortunate. If we had brought the ferret or something along that lines, we would have at least a well, not a balancer, but something that could get in there, get some back shots on people. All right. Well, here comes the bomber. They're not... What are they doing? Receiving you. They kind of have us, but they're not... They don't have us, because they're not doing anything. Do I want to close, then? Uh, let's... Mm, uh... Got to consider where the avatar is going to be positioned too. Let's get to here. Location confirmed. Let's get try and get rid of this Gauss rifle. Affirmative. 
At least the tag hit. Confirmed. Tag's been the most consistent thing so far. Look at that. Like through a couple of them, it's like 89 mines. All right, we got a sprint. Moving to full throttle. 39. 52 in the back of the scatty. Let's take this shot. I'm on him. Yes. Good to go. All right, let's drop some more of this uh, instability. On my way. Garbage. Garbage. It's all garbage. Well, if we can land one here, maybe we can pull this guy down. Got it. Nope. Negative damage. Ready for orders. All right, let's hopefully we can hit hope this hope we can hit this guy on the side. All right, a little bit of damage. God, it's brutal. Our initiative's tanked again. So this guy's going first. But this guy's already gone. So 14. No. Wait, what? No, we went on 19. Oh, right, never mind. These two guys go then. Let's see what they do. I think they're like, I mean, these guys, this guy's got a ton of SRMs, which is scary. But it's splash, so it's not that bad. This guy's the one I'm worried about, the pinpoint damage guy. Something weird's going on. Orders. I gotta move this way because if these guys keep going, I'll be out of their at least arc of fire. Hopefully, we can hit this guy here. Nice. Yes. Good. Goss rifle finally gone. Hostile eliminated. This guy's got a bomb rack, I think, left. It says one missile, but I think it's a bomb rack. Or it could be a missile pack. I don't wreck a rocket pack. Or no, maybe it was an SRM-4 or something. It was something. Well, it's obviously something, but... Find out here. Okay. Reporting major armor loss. Yeah, I see that. Damage is light. Oh, yeah. I got you. You got me? Don't get me, get this guy. Um, or we try for the kill in the scatty. I don't think we'll get the kill in the scatty. Let's do some damage to the... Uh, wait, what was that other one? Holy shit. Put the thunderbolt after everything else and it might get through. Let's try and take this shot. I'm on him. No, it didn't get through. Orders? We had to take the chance. Yes, Commander. These guys really want this avatar, and I don't blame them. Let's go here. I copy. We have any resolve? We do. Take the instability completely out. Let's just give it all to this guy. Firing at enemy. This guy just gave it to us. See ya. He didn't move, so core. Eliminated. Core explosion. I'm out of short range missiles. Sorry. Right. Maybe they just maybe that guy just gave up. Maybe that was what it was. He's like, nah, fuck this, I'm done. We can't win now. I give up. 
And honestly, I don't blame him. I mean, it, it, it is Jenkins, right? It's Jenkins. Roger that. They recognize the symbol. Like, fuck that. We lost. We had one shot at it. We had one shot at it and couldn't get it out. Get it, couldn't get it done, so we're done. All right, this guy's going on 17. They can still kill the uh, stealth, so i got to be very careful here. I should send the... Um... God, he keeps missing with that plasma cannon, thank God. Ready for orders. Okay, so you are... Let's just go back up here. You're damaged on this side. But I'm taking the better chance to hit. We gotta start applying damage to this guy. Target confirmed. Wow, you have not hit at all. That's a miss. Sorry, any low percentage chances he hasn't hit. Everybody else is at least getting tags on, but this guy? This guy can't be relied on to do anything. Yeah, I don't know what the... Orders? Yeah, the AI is just borky. I don't know what it's doing. It's the vehicles. The mechs seem to be fine, but the vehicles just seem to be doing weird stuff. Standing by. Got it. Get back on this guy again. Just keep going to see if we can kill him off. There we go. See ya. Hostile removed. Yep. You might as well go after the. Uh, can't shoot anybody. This thing doesn't move very fast either. Waiting for orders. But that plasma cannon is ten tons, so. Bit of a deal. Move order received. Surround this guy, see if we can make him nervous, maybe get him to bail out. Alright, firing. Good angle. Fire. Good angle with good percentage chance to hit, but only hit only land one. Confirm. Yeah, fuck him. Give him the Thunderbolt as well. I'll pass the armor. Oh, Thunderbolt hit! Long-range missiles are out. Standing by. God, I'm so nervous about this. That was a misclick, but it turned out to be in my favor. So, oh my God, he hit the other side. Really? Got it. Okay, tags on. Good news for us. Burned a lot of his AMS this turn. Ah, shit, we're in fire. Oof. Damage is minor, Commander. Standing by. Good thing he chose to shoot you, though. Move on this side. Great chances to hit. Yeah, this thing runs so cool, even with the uh, standing in fire and plus 15 heat, it's still super, super cool. Engaging with the See ya. Hit him hard. Oh, now you hit all four. Enemy down. Now you Order. hit all four. Let me get Copy you up this down. way. The only guy that really hasn't taken any damage. Yeah, I'm liking the Centurion with the, uh... Commander. I'm liking the Centurion on with the way. AC-20 on it. The rotary was nice, but it's like, it jams a fair bit and... I'm here. Uh, let's just get up here just in case some Copy shit that. goes off. Confirm. With iron sides here. This should theoretically do it. Let's go. Oh, nope. Well, that's our pickup spot. The asset is in hand, Commander. There it is, folks. That was tough. Yeah, I mean, if that... I mean, I know it's a battle against the AI, but if that battle teaches you anything, 
It, it teaches you that front-loading damage... Look at this, he wants to take all the parts. Yeah, no thanks. Um, front-loading damage gets you nowhere unless you can fit, like, like finish up and kill the enemy right afterwards. We got two parts of the Ifrit. It's actually really, really nice. We already have a Scatty, so I don't need one of these guys. As much as I want to take the Quick Sell, but we can't. Another AMS Mark II. Medium Rex Laser, Quick Sell. Gonna drop that in temporarily, so then lose PPC. So he was shooting a PPC, not a plasma cannon at me, so it's a good thing he was missing with that thing. Heavy Pharaoh, Night Vision, Peel and Stick, Improved Sensors, Sensor Probe. The fuck? Does it go in the sensor slot? I guess it probably does. Yeah, Arrow 4. Yeah, they had a lot of stuff. Fast Gam Bombs. Man, they just pelted me. SR oh, okay. Artemis SRMs. Hmm. Those work great on a really fast mech with a lot of SRMs. They're the last we've got. So I think we take parts. We've already got an AMS Mark II. I don't think I need more than one. We got three of them? Oh, never mind then. I should probably check that in the last battle. Maybe we take the two Efreet parts. The Nidhogg's nice. Why is it not showing me the parts here, though? Maybe it only works for mechs? Maybe. I don't know, it was working before. I mean, this way at least we have a fully free, but... Like, that's an SRM-20. That's actually pretty good with an AMS Mark II. Four Bomb Infernos, four Bomb Inferno Mines. And half-decent armor. But it really is a quick strike. You, you fly in, you do your thing with the Infernos and the Bomb Mines, and then you pull back and then use it as a secondary. Use the AMS to cover your guys, and then if you have to dart in again with the SRMs to take somebody out, you can do that. The bonus about these things is that they assemble so quickly. Let's just grab two of those parts. As much as I want the Nidhogg. I mean, it does have superior armor, superior firepower. But we don't have any parts, right? It's 45. Yeah, we don't have any parts. So, I mean, at least this way we can assemble this. If we so choose, which we probably will. All right, let's confirm that. We got two yellow jacket parts, no big deal. Another AMS Mark II. I could probably just sell that. Four of them is a bit much. Heavy rocket launcher, 10. SRM, 4. We can get rid of this guy. How many Artemis do we have now, too? We can sell that one. Two standard. Heavy Pharaoh's not bad. Proof sensors. Sensor probe we got. Okay, that can go. And we got some Artemis ammo and some quick sell ammo. Which really is just... Variable damage, and it's just weird. <laughs> a little a little extra number of shots, but uh, weird-ass damage. So, yeah, not too bad. Ooh, 185,000. Yeah, it's because of the armor on the uh, Avatar. It's always going to be pricey when that thing goes into battle. All right, well, that's not too bad. I mean, we dropped and we came back with the same amount of money. It just We just put everything into... into uh, <laughs> do repairs, unfortunately. I think it's just the primary lance that's in repairs, right? Yeah. So it's seven days before they come back, which isn't too bad. When we come back next time, we're going to take another uh, mission here with the uh, main lance. Take off Let's your just shoes. see. Make yourself Is anything good here? I mean, we got to destroy base we could try in the jungle. That's probably the, the map that I hate the most. But we could try that one and see. Two and a half against two, is it, though? Um, local government, so maybe not. I don't know. That was too easy last time. I don't, we'll, we'll figure it out. I don't know what we're going to do next time. Yeah, the Perseus. We've got a few mechs that we got to assemble still, but we've got the um, 
go to the mech bay real quick. Hey, I got to work on, now that we've got some coin in the bank, once we pass the financial report, we'll have a couple of million left. I want to see how much we can get off the next mission. Then we can start putting the Orion and the uh, Rabid Coyote together. Most likely what will end up happening is the Avatar will come down, the Orion will stay here, Rabid Coyote will move up, right? And then we can, we've got the Perseus and we've got, um, go to storage here real quick. We've got a few others. We've got the Perseus, which we can bring forward, 70 tonner. Um, we get the Bushwhacker. I mean, we've run Bushwhackers in the past, so maybe not that one. Maybe the Bombard? I don't know. Something. Or maybe we do bring the Whacker forward. I don't know. That's a lot of missile hard points. This could be a nice SRM brawler. I'm not sure yet. We'll see how it goes. Maybe we just run with three heavy mechs to start, and then when we can pick up another one, we'll run with four. And we leave the uh, the Bombard and the uh, the Bushwhacker out for now. But anyway, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe. And go check out the Quick Sell site. And until next time, we'll see you later.